Hello guys, in this video, we will create a portal material in Unreal Engine. Okay, let's create a material and change the blend mode to translucent and the shading model to unlit. Also, we need to set it. Okay, now add a texture sample and select a noise texture. And we need a vector to radio value. This function can make our noise texture looks like to move towards the center of the texture, like this. Now let's preview it. And we can see there are some white alias in here, which is not exactly what we want, so let's fix it. Just change MIP value mode to MIP level. Yes, it worked. Now let's add a panel to create an animation effect. Speed X to 0.1. It controls the rotation of the texture. And speed Y also 0.1. It looks like it's shrinking towards the center. Also, we can set the speed y to negative 0.1. Now it looks like it's expanding outward. Okay, we need negative 0.1 and speed x to 0.1. Now let's copy this node and change the noise texture. Now let's blend these textures. We use the blend screen. If we don't know how these blend functions blend, we can add them to the material editor and preview it. For example, blend color burn, just connect this texture and preview it. Yes, this is how it blend. Here we use the blend screen. Its blend effect is like this. Now let's add a step. The step returns 0 or 1 for every value of x depending on whether it's greater than or less than the reference value in y. Ok, and add a radial gradient exponential. It looks like a sphere. Connect it to steps x and preview it. Now we can see the shape of portal. Now let's add some tiling to texture. Multiply it by a 2D vector. Set x to 3 and y to 1. Copy tiling nodes to another texture. And set x to 2. Also, we need to change the speed to make it faster. Speed y to negative 0.5. This speed is also negative 0.5 and speed x to negative 0.1. Ok, it looks better. Now, let's add an emissive edge. First, we need a radius 0.5 and copy radial gradient exponential to make the edge. Also, we need a larger radius, so 0.5 and 0.1. Actually, it's not necessarily 0.1, it means our edge widths. Connect this node and preview it. We can see it's larger. So subtract the small one. We can get an edge. Yes, this is what we want. And we can multiply it by a color. And the large one connect to opacity. Now we get a simple portal material. Ok, let's see it in the level. Add a plane and use the material. 
it looks good. And uh, we can scale it to make it larger in the level. Okay, that's all for this video. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.